The Apanyal Pont Adimer is a diligent breed and is typically easy to train and is fun-loving and affectionate. It was recognized by the United Kennel Club in 1996. Very popularly known as the Little Clown of Marshes in France, the Apanyal Pont Adimer is a French dog and is also known to be a descendant of the Picardy Spaniel. It has always been a rare breed and saw a rapid decline in population after World War II. Rarely identified as family pets, they are usually best in gundog environments and are usually water dogs. During the early 20th century, these dogs were used to hunt wild ducks in wet conditions. This rare breed of dog is known to have originated in the 19th century and owe their origin to several different water spaniel breeds. However, owing to their decreasing population, these dogs were, around 1980, merged with the Picardy Spaniel to avoid extinction. They are known to have allegedly originated in France's pont Adimer region. These dogs are playful and cheerful. Therefore, if kept as a pet, it will keep your home lovely and lively. The grooming needs of this dog breed are simple, which means that they wouldn't need too much of your attention and are easier to keep as a pet. Adimers are known to be great family companions and are especially known to be great with children, thus making a wonderful choice of a pet. If you're looking to keep a pet that helps you with being a watchdog, this might not be the best choice. These dogs are known to be very affectionate and are too kind to be good watchers. This breed requires a great deal of daily physical activity, otherwise, they just turn lazy and lethargic. Since these dogs require a great deal of space, small apartment owners might want to look for other pet options. These dogs would be ideal for bigger spaces. The Apanyal Pont Adimer is an elegant medium-sized dog with a muscular and sturdy body and a deep chest. It has padded paws with medium-length legs. It has beautiful hair that drapes upon its head giving the appearance of a curly wig. It has round eyes and longish ears. The curly hair is also found on its tail and may be red or brown. It also has shorter hair on the face. However, the longer, denser hair falling from its head is what makes it able to bear the extreme wintry conditions. Like all other animals, this breed has health conditions to watch for. Canine hip dysplasia, a condition relating to the hip sockets, can cause arthritis in dogs. These dogs are also prone to von Willebrand's disease, a bleeding condition involving clotting, and hyperthyroidism, overproduction of hormones in the thyroid. Aside from those concerns, kneecap dislocation and dental problems are the most common health issues encountered by this breed. Alopecia, a skin disease caused by ringworms or other parasites, can also affect these dogs. The Apanyal Pont Adimer is affectionate and shows seamless loyalty toward its masters. However, without getting its regular dose of attention, these dogs can often get anxious, which is a major trait of its personality. These dogs are especially great with kids and are very social. They also make great playmates and family companions. However, if you are looking for a good watchdog, this might not be the best choice as they are too kind and laid back to guard anything or anyone. This breed is great with other dogs but does not fare well with dogs of the same breed that do not belong to the same pack or group. It is also not very friendly towards other pet animals. However, puppies of this breed easily mingle with other animal pets and are known to have a friendly behavior towards them. Pet owners need to know what their dog needs nutritionally. This breed often needs about 2.25 to 2.75 cups of high-quality dry dog food. Apanyal Pont Adimer puppies need a diet that is rich in animal-based protein including dried chicken and turkey. They also need food products that are rich in omega-6 and omega-3 fatty acids. In adult dogs, chicken is a great source of protein that helps in building their muscles for a stronger body. The hair and fur on these dogs could look like they need a lot of grooming but in reality, this breed needs little to no maintenance at all. A regular brushing once or twice every week is all that's required. However, the dog's ears require cleaning on an as-needed basis and are at risk of an infection if not kept clean.